This is Mario's Meteor with a custom paint job. He's flown many, many times. Okay, Mario. See what happens here, my brother. Show us how it's done. comfortable come in the other way otherwise you're going to have the wind to your back Like that. Neither did I. Yeah. I was yeah. I was more worried about the grass. I know. I yeah. thought I, I thought I turned it right around and had it perfect. Yeah. Oh, darn it. It's minor. It's minor. Yeah. But still I thought I thought I agree I was gonna grease it on the edge there. Huh. Hey John, ready. Graphics are from the oh, full scale. Yeah. 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 Okay, Johnny, what are we running it on today? We're Take running it on uh, 9S. What's the milliamp, John? 3700. 3700 HV packs. Graphene oxides. Sweet. So this is a 4.35. Per cell? Yeah, very cool. John was telling me earlier, or Johnny was telling me earlier that it's pulling 135 amps and he's got a 120 ESC. <laughs> so he's got to be a little careful. How's it feel, Johnny? Feels good. Feel like you got extra power?
Sounds great. I, mean. <laughs> I love that sound. Sweet, Johnny. Yeah, I like that performance. I think those are getting glued on. <laughs> is that a canard landing? Yeah. <laughs> That's why the nose is like. When they go down. So, Johnny, tell us a little bit about what we did on the um, on the vents again. These guys right here. Okay, these, yeah. The openings were too big, and I had made flat wedges. They performed pretty good, and then I switched the wedges to a different one, and they weren't too good. Then I made these, and they were too big, they didn't have performance. I sanded them down, now I got good performance, and now I'm going to glue them on and finish it. Got our final version. Final version. Yeah. Very cool. Thank you. Super big game with the graphics now off of the full scale. And just as it says, the show must go on. Oh, definitely. Johnny's got the uh, prototypes on his wedges. He's going to talk the about the first wedge for testing to close down the opening. This was the second wedge that I thought was going to be the wedge and it didn't perform in the air as, at all. And then that's the final wedge. Sanded down. Sanded down, which I'm going to permanently put in. Yeah. Very cool. Thank you. Sorry, Nick. <laughs> Thank you. 
go to vertical tonight. Setting up for landing. Landing. You see the guy run across the runway right before you? So Nick, tell us a little bit about the plane. What is it? A, how many millimeters? Uh, it's a Jet Tang, 120 millimeter Viper mm -hmm. with a Jet Fan 120 running on uh, 12S and uh, 590 KB Jet Fan. <clears throat> Beautiful plane. Ooh. How did it stop so easily? Huh? How did it stop so easily? I don't know. Because you got brakes in there, right? Well, like, yeah, Jet Tang electric brakes and uh -huh. Jet Tang retracts. Yeah. You know, it's just beautiful. Yeah. It did everything I asked it to do the whole flight. Yay. Very cool. You gonna, <clears throat> you gonna take it up on your maiden flight? Yeah. So tell us a little bit about it. What's it flying on and what, what is it? HSD Super Viper, 105 millimeter, uh, 12 cell setup, um, pretty much ready to go. So Very cool. Made in flight? Yes. Very cool. <laughs> brakes or no brakes? Uh, they don't exactly work. <laughs> But it does have brakes though. Yeah. Yeah. give you the weather report too? No. <laughs> <laughs> Two sixes.
extension and now on the turnaround. <laughs> Kevin, thank you again for the extension <laughs> and all the guys that work on it. Uneventful maiden, that's yep. what we like. <laughs> Uneventful. Very cool.